What's going on guys? Today I'm going to do a quick review of the Govi Smart Space Heater. In this review, I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about the space heater, including one thing you should know before buying. Alright guys, so we've been checking out different uh, space heaters as of late, and these, uh, this particular one here is actually really, really cool. So I just want to talk to you about all the features and everything. So just like any space heater, you know, it has a few different options here. So there's obviously the power, uh, plus or minus if you want to increase or decrease heat. These are the different modes, which I'll explain in a second. This is the light, which you can actually change the colors of that. In the app, yes, there is an app. We'll talk about that. I'll show you how that works as well. Um, and then right here is where we can do the timer. Uh, this is if you want to, you know, reduce temperature. I, I said that the plus minus temperature. And then this is the oscillation as well. So uh, a lot of different features on this one. Um, and like I said, there's an app. I will show that in a minute to show you how that works. All right, guys, so talking about the different modes here. So uh, there is a fan mode, as you see. This basically is reading the ambient temperature around 79 degrees in this room right now. Um, and then, you know, like I said, it's fan. Also see that it's connected to Wi-Fi and also Bluetooth. Um, so I've already set it up and I'll show you the app, like I said. But mode right now is fan. Then we have auto. This is a cool uh, mode. I like auto a lot because basically you could say, hey, I want it to be this particular temperature. And then it will essentially, um, it will change to fan when it doesn't need that temperature. And then it'll go back to heat when it actually needs to get the temperature. So in other words, 79 right now, if it dropped to 77, it would turn back on the heat and then try to adjust to that temperature. Um, so that's the way that that actually works right there. Um, and then in addition to that, we have mode one, which is basically heat, not the strongest heat, but heat. Mode two, which is a stronger version of heat. It gets a lot warmer, a lot quicker. And then mode three, which is if it's really cold in the room, you turn it to mode three, it's going to get really warm really, really quick. And then this timer right here, this is a 24 hour timer. So you could set it up uh, to go up to 24 hours and it'll do that no problem whatsoever. So that all said, pretty uh, good space heater. I'd say it's a, about two feet, maybe a little bit bigger. Um, it really does warm up super, super quick. Uh, it's actually getting kind of warm in here already. Uh, warms up super quick, has no problem whatsoever. Very sturdy um, and everything with it from that perspective is really good. But let me show you the app because this thing does not come with a remote control of any sort. A lot of them do. This one actually has an app, which is a pretty nifty and cool thing. So let me show that to you. All right, guys. So here is the app. I'm trying to get the best uh, view of this that I can. I guess we'll just have to do this. So you can see right now it's 74 degrees. Uh, this is low, medium, high. So if I press low, oops, well, let me turn it on first. Oops. Uh, I just turned it on by pressing here. Uh, if right now it's on high, if we press low, just change to low. See how that's on one. And then we also have fan and auto. So these are the, basically the different modes. You can also adjust this. You can also just press like oscillate and see how it's oscillating so yeah it works like flawlessly this app took me i'd say probably two minutes to actually install didn't take anything at all if you're wondering um we can also put a night light on right and here which is kind of a neat little thing you can actually adjust there we go uh you can actually adjust the color to whatever color you like right which i think is pretty cool you can also adjust the brightness if you don't want it on you could turn that off as well um, and then here we have scheduling. So if you want to schedule this thing to go on and off at a certain time, timer. So if you want to time it, um, if you want to lock it, uh, which basically, well, I figured I should probably just show you. Um, this basically means that none of the buttons really will work on it, right? It basically locks people out of this up here. So it'll actually lock it. Um, the display, you can change it to always on or, or off. And then pair, pairing the thermo hygrometer, what that is, is um, basically you could put a device inside of your room and by putting it in your room, instead of relying on the sensor here uh, to understand the ambient temperature, et cetera, it would actually know the room's temperature. And then this would pair with that so that the room would always stay at a constant temperature. And in terms of the one thing to know about this, guys, um, before you actually buy, and it's slightly annoying, really not that big of a deal, but you actually have to, this I have to uh, fix, but you have to assemble this bottom part um, of this. It really doesn't take much to assemble, but just make sure that you read the instructions. It's a little bit annoying the way that they did this. Definitely not a deal breaker. This thing's totally worth the money, but it is a little bit annoying, the bottom part of it. I didn't really like that part of it. Uh, it just took a second to actually figure out how to put it together and run the uh, wire through, etc. 
Didn't take me too long, probably, you know, three, four minutes or something like that. But just make sure that you read the directions before you uh, do that. So yeah, guys, my take overall on this thing, it is a pretty awesome uh, smart space heater. I have not been able to find one that's as cool as this. The fact that it has the app, has the light, all these different things that it has, um, don't take that for granted. It is really cool functionality, a lot of cool technology in this thing. I really like that it can pair with uh, the temperature sensor externally as well as the internal thing. Just a really cool device. So if you're considering getting it, uh, I definitely, definitely would give the thumbs up on this one. Don't think that you'll regret it at all and hope that you enjoy.